Greetings fellow Dragon Ball fans and collectors, I'm the DBZ Collector, and this is the Master Lies Extra, back to the film, Final Form Cooler, from Bandai Namco, and Bandai Spirits. He was released on September 24th, 2021, and I got him from EntertainmentEarth.com, but they are sold out, but I'll include links to other places that sell this figure in the description box below. With that out of the way, let's begin. What are you talking about? I kill when I want. The weak die and the strong survive. <laughs> Alright then, enough of that. Here he is in all of his glory. Other figures wish they can be like him. Wanna know why? Because he's cooler. Just a little DBZ dad joke there for you. Anywho, even though he's wearing a mask, they captured his likeness extremely well. Looks just like his anime counterpart. It would be cool if they included another head without the mask, showing an angry face or something. I was thinking a detachable mask would be awesome, but I think it risks being sculpted too big and not looking right. Bandai Spirits did a wonderful job sculpting this figure. He's got great muscle detail, with some veins popping out here and there. Got some on his stomach and legs, veins on his arms and some on his feet. They should have put some veins on his tail. Pretty sure it's a powerful tail, so some veins would have shown that off. The sculpt of the armor looks great. You could put a chain in between here and wear him as a necklace. Isn't like ice a slang term for uh, jewelry? You put ice in a cooler. Little joke there for you. Here he is next to the Master Star's piece, Frieza. I wish the blue parts on cooler were made of plastic, like with the purple on the Frieza, instead of just painted on. But they are nicely painted though. I like the uh, contrasting shades of blue. The purple looks great as well. Would make Thanos proud. This figure has some nice subtle shading all throughout. I like that the shading on the white part of the figure is gray, as opposed to blue, as a lot of figures as of recent do that. I don't know why. And here he is compared to the Figure Arts Zero Final Form Cooler in the Banpresto World Figure Coliseum First Form Frieza in the Matchmakers Final Form Frieza Full Power. Here he is compared to the 2008 Tokyo Toy Festival King Cold and the Dragon Ball vs. Omnibus Z Final Form Frieza. And here he is compared to the Super Decisive Battle of the World Division Kaioken times 3 Goku and the Banpresto World Figure Coliseum Super Master Stars Peace the Bardock the two dimensions version and here he is compared to the Grandista Resolution of Soldiers Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black and the Dragon Ball vs. Omnibus Z Legendary Super Saiyan Broly and here he is compared to the Super Decisive Battle of the World Division Vegeta and Nappa. Here he is compared to the Grandista, Super Saiyan Goku, and Super Saiyan Vegeta. Both are the Manga Dimensions versions. And here he is compared to the Ichiban Kuji, Super Dragon Ball Heroes 3rd Mission, Super Saiyan 4, Full Power Limit Breaker Broly, and the Red Masked Saiyan. Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black. Uh, on behalf of the departed, that it isn't a woman's responsibility to see that the seat is down, it's a man's responsibility to put it down. It's not that hard. Yeah, it's not hard. Putting the toilet seat down isn't that hard. 
So is it too much? Hello, ma'am. We're the Toilet Safety Administration. The what? After the recent tragedy, new safety regulations require us to check every toilet for security. It's interesting, but we'll go ahead and install your safety belt. Safety belt? Federal law requires all toilets to be fitted with a safety harness so that nobody can fall in. Did you can't make me wear a seatbelt to take a dump? This is for your safety. A woman died, you know. Yeah, but the blood's on Clyde's wiener, not mine. By the way, he comes in three pieces. His head his tail, and the rest of his body. He comes with an ankle support, but he does not need it. Alrighty, then that concludes this review. If you enjoyed it, then go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If not, then give me a thumbs down. But I hope you enjoyed it. And if you have this figure, then let me know in the comment section below your thoughts and opinions on them. If you do not have them, let me know what you think based on what you see in the video. And if you'd like to buy this figure, then as I mentioned earlier, in the description box below, you'll find links to places that sell this figure. And if you don't want to miss any future reviews, then go ahead and hit the subscribe button, followed by the bell icon, so you don't miss anything. Thank you for watching, and have a nice day.